never realized you felt like this. Now, I have no idea. I don't know. I, I guess I've just been so, so self-involved. I haven't. lives, then I'm grateful. But my music is very personal. It comes from my loves, my hates, my concerns, and my feelings, Lord Melchizedek. <coughs> and people respond to my music because it reflects their feelings. But whatever the reason, I have a lot of respect for them. The world is full of nothing. It really all depends upon the individual. Uh -huh. Well, I do believe it's time for a bit of it. Old black magic. <laughs> hey, call on your first witness, babe. Right. I would like to call upon my witness, my star witness. Captain Ebony, would you please take a stand? Star witness, huh? Mm -hmm. I like that. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Let the record show. The witness in this time is Captain Ebony, most recent pseudonym, Sam. Dean Paul. He held the position of space pilot 
on the late planet Hydra. He escapes the dispersal of that planet due to a piloting mission in the outer galaxies and sought refuge on the planet Earth. Form description, galactic humanoid with high level of technology and science, average intelligence and high emotional output. Proceed. Thank you. Captain Ebony, <clears throat> would you please tell the court where you have spent the last three years? Why on the old terra firma, grooving my way around the globe? So would we be correct in thinking that you must have come in contact with many different people, cultures, nationalities? Well, I experienced. I, uh, left my mark all over the place. <laughs> yes, sir, I'm sure you did. Woo, yes, I did. Uh, now, can we take it that while on Earth you, uh, got to know many people and made many, uh, friends? You know it. <laughs> now, now tell the court. Did you find these people, by and large, to be hospitable, generous, kind? Objection. The defense is leading, witness, Sir Stay. Oh, I get it. Ca Captain Ebony, would you please tell the court, in your own words, what you thought of the Earth's people? Well, I arrived on the Earth with a slightly biased opinion. You see, I had listened to the computates which contained all data concerning previous visitations to the Earth. Now, they found the Earth people to be, by and large, backward. Hostile, selfish, what? Uh, you know that sort of thing. Yeah, but what, what did you find them to be like? By and large, yeah. Back with hostile and selfish. Whose side are you on? It would appear that your star witness does not have too high an opinion of your Earth. Well, that's not strictly true, Your Honor. I must admit that on my travels, I did see misery and suffering that you would not believe. And just as I am beginning to think that I am in the moral garbage dump of the universe, Hey, I hear it for the first time. Man, it was something else. Oh, really? What did you hear? I heard soul. So. Yes. So. Yeah, that good old rock and roll. The beat, the power, the energy. Hey, it just lifted me up and I was gone. And I said to myself, So, anyone who can produce this sound can't be all bad. This is absurd. Yeah. So. You liked our music. <laughs> Keep the faith. My Lord Melchizedek, do you wish to cross the sand? I do, Your Honor. We mustn't disappoint the captain. I mean business this time. No. Ed. You've already admitted that not only were you an illegal visitor upon the Earth, but you also interfered with the official transport beam. And by these admissions, you have proven you're a person who has no qualms about breaking the law. I object, Your Honor. Yes. Captain Ebony's not the one on trial here. I'm trying to establish that as a witness, he is neither reliable nor trustworthy. Oh, but my Lord, the witness has verified much of what the prosecution has said, even in so far as jeopardizing his own case. Right on. <laughs> uh, I uh, quite agree. <clears throat> Um, I, I think as far as this court is concerned, you know, Captain Ebony may be taken at face value. You know, surely you would agree. Oh, absolutely. Yes. So, so say, you must resist this reasoning, my lord. Oh, it's all right, Your Honor. Oh, the whole solar point knows how he feels about me. Feel about you? I have no feeling about you. But I know what you're feeling about me. You feel. I don't like you. You feel, I don't like you at all, you want me out of your
Continue your defense. Captain Ebony has chosen me to represent the people of the planet Earth. Boy, I wish I shared his faith in me. <laughs> 